Hi everyone. So I got quite a lot of books um, within the last few months. I know I should stop buying but I can't help it because these books are so, so cheap. So I went to two um, different book sales. First is the popular book sale. It was like in November um, at the Viva Expo Hall in KL and every single book there was five ringgit each. And the second one I went to was of course Big Bad Wolf and this time it was at the mine. So yeah, I'm just going to show you the books that I got. So from the Viva Expo Hall, I got a lot of books because they're all five ringgit and the books are like so awesome. It's the first one is My Life Next Door by Huntley Fitzpatrick. And I've seen a lot of people on Instagram like read this book. Next is We Are All Completely Beside Ourselves. See, I've heard like pretty good things about this one. So yeah, when I saw it, I'm like, I gotta have it. Next is A Stranger Like You. I looked up on the internet for reviews about it and it had good reviews. So yeah, it sounds like a really cool, mysterious, emo kind of book. So I bought it. Throne of Glass. Uh, this is a very popular series by Sarah J. Mass, but I could only find the first book and I don't really like the cover. They actually have really nice other editions of this book, but you know, it's five ringgit and I, it's a really good book, so yeah, why not? I got this book. But the next book I got is Prodigy. I finally have completed this series from book sales. Like, I got the first book and the third book, and I was trying to search for this book um, at the last Big Bad Wolf, but I couldn't find it. So I found it at this one, which is awesome because now I can finally start the series, and I heard it's a very good series, so maybe you guys should try it out too and tell me how you think of it. Should be good. Next, I got um, A Storm of Swords by, uh, what's his name? George R. R. Martin. He's the author of the Game of Thrones um, series, you know, that show, but I heard the books are better, so I'm gonna read the books. This is actually, they're both the third book, but split into two because it's like so big, like these books are so huge, but I heard they're very enjoyable, and there's so many books, like this guy is like really old, and they're hoping that he doesn't die before he completes the series, so let's hope not. Yeah. Next, I got the Anna and the French Kiss books. Anna and the French Kiss, and the next one is Lola and the Boy Next Door. This is the third book, but I couldn't find it, but that's okay. I got these two lovely books. They are so pretty, and I heard they're one of the best contemporary books um, right now. So, you know, I was really surprised to find these at the book sale because they're very popular among bookworms, and they're for five ringgit each. The last one I got from this book sale is Let It Snow by John Green, uh, Maureen Johnson, and Lauren Miracle. Miracle. Yeah. So now I'm going to show you the books that I got from the Big Bad Wolf um, Minds book sale. Okay. So the first book that I got, I got this. It is Fantastic Bees and Where to Find Them by J.K. Rowling. If you're a Potterhead, which I'm pretty sure most of you are, you'd know that Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them is like one of the books mentioned in Harry Potter, like it's one of the books they use um, at Hogwarts. And J.K. Rowling actually wrote it, you know, she actually wrote the book. It's actually um, kind of like a dictionary of magical creatures, something like that. And the cover is just so pretty and it was for five we can get that big bad wall. J.K. Rowling, you're a genius. Next, I got Lemony Snicket Spokes. A series of uh, unfortunate events. I got four of them. They're so pretty. But I don't think I'm going to read them yet. I don't think I'm going to keep them yet. I'm going to give them to my friend because he is such a big fan of it um, back in college. And I might read it sometime, some other time. I'm the type of person who needs all of the books there before I start it. So since I only have four of them, I think there's like 12 books, I don't feel like reading them yet. But I really think the covers are so beautiful. Like the illustrations are just awesome. Like Moshe Moore. See? So this was a different edition though. But it's funny. I got exactly two non-fiction books at Big Bad Wolf. You guys should be proud that I'm finally reading something useful. Like more useful. Okay, the first one is um, the bedside. Baccalaureate, Baccalaureate, I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, it's basically um, books like about 
general knowledge kind of things where they actually explain in detail like things like I don't know but they they look really cool and they're pretty and they are only for eight ringgit. I also got um, Survivor by Chuck Palahniuk. I don't know how to pronounce that. But he's the author of Fight Club. I wanted to find Fight Club because I heard that the book's really good and the movie's awesome, but I couldn't find it. So I got this one instead. Um, the next one I got, this one is from the second time I went, is A Thousand Splendid Sons by Khalid Hosseini. Hosseini. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, he is the author of The Kite Runner. This is like his second book or something. And I just had to get it when I saw it was a ring game because it's quite a bestseller and people have said it's really good and I'm actually reading this right now. It's really good so far. I read like five pages but it's really good. Okay, I also got Dr. Bird's Advice for Sad Poets. I think it's about life or something. It has a pretty cover but this one's for 10 ring because it's a hard cover but it's awesome. And yeah, the cover is pretty. I think. Okay, I already said that. I also got Requiem by Lauren Oliver. This is the third book in the, um, what's it called? Um, Delirium. It is the third book in the Delirium trilogy. So I finally got the third one, so that's pretty cool. But I haven't read the second and third one yet. Uh, the second one yet, so we kind of have to get to that. Okay, the next one I got is The Catastrophic History of You and Me. Um, the reviews on Goodreads say that it's a really good book, so I bought that. And the cover is really pretty, and it's hardcover, so yeah. So those are all the books that I got from the book sales. But before the book sales, I also bought three other books online from thebookroom.com. I'll put the link in the bio in the description because um, it's a really good website for cheaper books that you guys can check out. Um, I actually got the Shatter Me Trilogy. Yeah. Um, yeah, because I heard they're good. But I read the first one. The first one is Shatter Me. So yeah, I put the stuff in there. Yeah, it, it's okay lah. It's not bad. The ending makes it really good. I'm supposed to read this one, but I don't know, the start's not that good for me. I just hope it gets better, so taking a break from it. The third one is Ignite Me. The covers are just so pretty. They're like really fancy eyes and they're just awesome. Okay, I'm really sorry. This one's a pretty long one. I just bought a lot of books, so I just thought you know, I'd share them. So yeah, tell me what you guys are reading right now and recommend me books that you think are really good that I just have to read. Or just, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Okay, bye guys. Have a great day.